where we should be having these conversations. The College of Bishops, though, has uh, talked about this resolution, and we would like to offer this statement as some parameter around which the conversation might unfold. The College of Bishops has studied this resolution and has determined that unless it is amended, the petition as presented is out of order. Our rationale is that this petition calls bishops to act contrary to the judicial process provisions found in paragraphs 363 and 2701, as well as Judicial Council decisions 1111, 1120, and 1220. Specifically, Judicial Council Decision 1120 states, an annual conference may adopt a resolution on human sexuality that is aspirational in nature. However, an annual conference may not negate, ignore, or violate the discipline, even when the disagreements are based upon conscientious objections to those provisions, unquote. This same application applies to the work of a jurisdictional conference. In addition, this petition would call upon bishops to violate specific responsibilities of an Episcopal leader, specifically found in paragraphs 414.9, 415.2, and 415.3 of the Book of Discipline. We believe that unless there are amendments or substitutions made in the subsequent discussion of this petition, that make the mandated language more aspirational in nature, this petition will be out of order and thus null and void. We wanted to provide you with as much clarity uh, as possible on why this is potentially out of order. And I wanna state my willingness to receive any amendments or substitutions that may make this petition in order. The petition is now before you for your consideration and your conversation. Yes, microphone.